In this episode, we travel from Norfolk, Virginia, down through the Dismal Swamp Canal and onward to Belhaven, North Carolina. We entered the lock the next morning, bright and early, and as the water was filling up, we made friends with the motor yacht in front of us, who we ended up following all the way to Elizabeth City. Gotta get primitive. Hi. River's Danger Dove, how are you enjoying your cruise so far? Okay. I'll, I'll take that as a, a very well. Thank you. It's pretty darn uh, peaceful, I gotta say. You can get past the fact that when you flush the toilet, it doesn't appear that you're actually accomplishing anything. Because the water is pretty gross. <laughs> Over on the dismal swamp. Relatively carefree, except for the fact that we've bumped at least three submerged fogs, and one of those knocked out our knot. So hopefully, when we track that thing, we're just gonna find uh, some chunks of fog in the paddle and just clean it out. I don't think we have any spare paddles. Not a huge deal, but. Yeah, you just can't, uh, can't see them. I'm up here on the bow seat, just uh, kind of keeping an eye out while Chris drives. You can see uh, a few dead heads sticking up or logs floating, but uh, some of them are just below the surface and you don't know until you hear a thump, you feel it. Just, you know. A little bit alarming, but we're still afloat, so I guess uh, I guess we're all right. Second lock now, Deep Creek, uh, Dismal Swamp Canal. I think it's called Southport Lock, maybe. Something like that. Pretty good passage, but 
I gotta say, uh, we bumped a lot. And I, I know that does happen, but like, <clears throat> we avoided everything we saw on the surface, which was a lot. And all the stuff that we hit was submerged, but probably five or six good thumps, one of which took out our knot meter. I think I mentioned that before, but we're gonna take that thing apart when we finally stop for the night. And hopefully it's just a paddle. But uh, it's really pretty, but I'm, I'm kind of glad to be out of there. I know none of those thumps were, did any real damage, hopefully. But I'm um, just kind of averse to hitting the bottom of things with the bottom of my boat, or the top of things with the bottom of my boat. I don't want to hit things. we stayed at that night was owned by a seafood supply company and as long as you sign a waiver saying that you'll eat at one of the restaurants downtown you get to stay for free so we did and we did are you ready are you ready for the storm yeah you're gonna have some fun sailing as a schedule. You get in a lot of trouble if you're forcing yourself to meet a schedule because it tends to make you go out in conditions uh, maybe when you shouldn't or, I don't know, not take the weather seriously enough. We've got plenty of time. So anyway, we, uh, we just kind of had a little fire drill getting out of the dock because we thought the bridge was gonna open and then we'd have to wait another half hour. Turns out we probably could have just asked it to open after nine. But at least it was a motivator. Yeah. It got us moving. And we got got through the drawbridge and just motored along on this lovely North Carolina summer day. We made fake eggs this morning. They weren't fake eggs, they were just egg whites. Yeah. We were trying to save space in the refrigerator little carton of egg stuff. It wasn't that bad. But yeah. It was a little unfulfilling. Yeah, that's... <laughs> Not touching that. <laughs> <laughs> We're fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> 
should win my arm. <laughs> right. <laughs> dapper today. You know, it says he likes to be formal, but he still likes to party. Focus up uh, negative one. Negative three? closing even though we didn't get it opening it's the alligator river swing bridge on demand alligator river is not what I'd call a barrel of laughs not a lot of frolicking water skiers or carefree tubers. Uh, you night alligators, they don't even like this place. That happens. Right there, and there's like not a single house. Shit, no. We got company over here. An alligator? No. Uh, cell phone, anchor. I've been searching Tell me where did we go Cause I don't know how to find us And I'm getting no help from you Like a slow flood Discontentment rises Sneaks up high enough that we can't be around and all love Baby, help me, help us Slap my face or cry on you Tell me I can't go straight to hell Your indifferent eyes are more than I can stand Safety precautions, 
caution. More men die <laughs> leaking off the back of boats. <laughs> yeah, <you're right. laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. Oh! First try! Oh. No. No, that was close. No. More arc. Yeah. All right, one more try. Oh, that was really good. This is more dismal than the dismal swamp. It is. It's quite dismal. But it's a lot deeper. Mm -hmm. So we're on the uh, Alligator River, Pongo River Canal. I forget what the exact name is. And uh, it's about a little bit after seven. And uh, it's pretty rainy, as you can see. So we got another couple hours to go to get to Bellhaven. And I think we're going to keep sticking it out. You know, it's, uh, it's all marked pretty clearly on the chart. It's a straight shot through this canal. Um, if, the, if it gets dicey or weird, we'll just go ahead and anchor out. But, plan is to try to get to the marina tonight, so we'll see what happens. Next time on Sailing SV Layla. Please take a moment to like and subscribe. And be sure to follow us on social media. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Cheers! Cheers.